Hey, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, everyone. This is your friend Sachin Rakhra, and welcome to our channel, Router and Switches Concepts. If you had not subscribed our channel, please hit subscribe button and click the notification bell icon with all. Okay, so let's jump into another topic. What is the next one? So next one is spanning tree. Okay, spanning tree, as everybody knows, what is spanning tree? Spanning tree is a basically a loop avoidance tool which help us to avoid the layer two loops actually in the environment. Okay, we'll see in Dell networking what, what all spanning tree protocol we can configure and how we can change the variety, spanning tree varieties and hello timers and forward timers so that uh, to optimize the spanning tree conversion in the network. Okay, let's jump into my lab. Okay, so in this, let's go and check that uh, what we have on the box. Okay, so the command is basically spanning tree. You can hit uh, question mark after that and see what all we have. Disable MAC cutter, flush timers, modes, okay, and MST, path cost, rapid PVST. And STP. So, in uh, in uh, Dell networking OS 10 uh, environment or Dell environment actually, uh, we we only support three type of uh, uh, STP protocols. One is basically RTP, R STP. Okay, another is basically rapid PVST, and uh, the next uh, spinning T is basically MST. Okay. So these these three these three protocols are only available in OS 10 or even in OS 9 also because the um, rest of the basically is Cisco proprietary we can't use that so we use all all open all open uh, spanning tree protocols so in in our lab today's lab actually we will will try to configure RSTP and uh, see how it is okay so for RSTP you have to go RSTP and hit okay so these these many options are available for us we are going to change the priority so for first switch we will be changing the priority to 4096 okay so 4096 and for second switch we will be using uh, 8192 okay before that to how to check whether the spanning tree is activated or not. So we have to run the command show spanning tree. Okay. So it is activated actually. Uh, it is activated for VLAN one only right now because on, on this box, on these two box, it's as you know, it is on lab actually and, and everything is uh, fresh. Uh, no VLAN, nothing is configured. So it says spanning tree enabled protocol, rapid PVST with force version RSTP. So by default, uh, OS 10 comes with rapid PVST, but I, I changed to RSTP, okay? So we'll, we'll try to change the uh, delay timers and, and, and hello timers on this, and we'll see. So same thing we have to do, spanning tree. Okay, you, you guys has noted that it's all the pro ports are basically in blocking because none of the ports are activated. So we'll show you. I have already sampled uh, another switch which is live and we can show you uh, uh, the configuration or the status of uh, spanning tree on that. So before that, we will quickly quickly change the forwarding uh, delay. Okay, every time you have to go to spanning tree and then forward, okay, so forward timer. So forward timer, we, we will go with four just for testing actually. The another thing actually will will change the hello timer. Hello. Okay, we'll, we'll change to, okay, right now it is two. Right now it is two actually. So we'll, we'll change to one. Okay. So so to check the configuration actually, you, you can quickly check show, span, uh, show running spanning tree. Okay, it will show you. So these, thing, these three things we have changed actually on this. So we'll we'll jump into some live switches and see how uh, uh, spanning tree looks when when it is activated and if the ports are connected and all. 
Okay, so in this switch, actually, if you see, the, these all are basically in forwarding state. Okay, forwarding state and and the designated uh, uh, bridge ID is basically eight one nine two. Okay, and this spanning tree tree enable protocol R S T P with force version is R S T P. Okay, and priority is eight one nine two, and this is the MAC address. Blah blah blah. And this is the whole uh, hello timer one, okay? And forward delay is four. So, so that's why I choose these options so that you can you can see on 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 the live uh, environment, okay? So we can show you another another also. So in this, uh, the uh, the bridge bridge priority value is basically uh, eight one nine two, but it is basically calculating based on based on the uh, environment actually what all switches is connected and all so the cost of the cost of the active ports are basically 800 the cost of the active ports are 800 and blocking ports are this two and i think uh, some zeros okay so this this port id if you notice actually first port first port start with 128.8 and it will go, it will divide 8, 16, 24, 32 likewise. Okay, so we'll see on on next slide what we have so that we can go into that also. Okay, hope this video is informative to you and it will help you to learn your networking skills. If you had not already subscribed our channel, please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon for all the notification of our new videos. Thank you.